Thank you so much for joining me, it's Gamage. We are back in Miss Survival Episode 2 with a brand new update. If you guys missed the last episode, you should check it out. Pretty darn cool. We've been having a little bit of fun. We can make a shield. There's a whole bunch of things we could do. And yes, I cowered up here. I did. And that's stupid me. I should have brought some food. <laughs> I ran for my life up here to make sure we can survive the night. Yeah, well, the night. The fog. The mist. The heck. Whatever that is. Yeah, it's probably it's mist. Uh, but yeah, there's definitely a lot we can do, and I suppose we have forgot some stuff you can see. Uh, these guys are lootable, but they have no loot. There was one there that died just recently, and uh, we'll grab another stick because I was crafting up some stick sticks uh, while we are doing that. So yeah, that's kind of interesting. Now, they shouldn't drop anything unless you kill them. Last I checked, and definitely something we have to be careful for. We'll have to look for, uh, maybe get some more food and go back in. Uh, some of you guys are mentioning I missed an axe at the trailer park just down there. So I'm hoping the mist is not going to come back for a second round in a row. Uh, so we're going to make our way over there. We'll drop everything off uh, that we can. I did have another locker I want to pick up on this side. And then bring it back here as much as possible. So we're going to grab whatever we possibly can. I'm not sure if we really need all the rocks that I'm picking up. Uh, I'm going to stop too much on those. But I do remember needing a whole lot of stuff. So we're all good. We're going to run it down here and make a do. Somebody told me they found an M4 up here. I was like, what? How did I how did I not get that? Why didn't I get that? Uh, but yeah, it looks like it's very random the loot you're gonna get around the area, so very nice. I do like a little bit of random loot. Uh, yeah, that's just a feather. <laughs> I was like, is there an M4 here? Uh, would be nice if there is one, but it doesn't look like there is one. So there's guns inside the game, it's good to know. And we found also these wonderful lockers here. Tons of loot, but we also found it. All right, you guys see that, right? Holy crap, the camp is loaded with people. Okay, uh, that I wasn't expecting. Uh, okay, so first day in, nobody inside the camp. Second day, so there was a couple of hot fixes. Maybe that was one of them? Uh, that's not good. That is, that's not really good. I just told somebody on the forums that there was nothing in here. Now there is. I'm sorry. I feel guilty now. Okay, our doors are back. Oh, God, I just realized the door's back. All right, that's that's wicked, wicked, wicked. We're going to take some of these here. We're going to rotate these suckers for now temporarily. We'll place them all nicely and stuff afterwards. Uh, but supposedly I forgot some stuff on the other side, the knacks and stuff. Maybe it's just randomized loot. I don't know. Uh, but it might be. It might be. All right. Whoa, dude. Okay, that crate's going there. Okay, that, that crate is going right there. Uh, again, no shift click. Hoping a developer will add that shift click in here. It's very, very important uh, just to make things a whole lot faster for us to do. I do have a loot option, I know, uh, but again, you know, it would be nice to have that little extra. All right, let's go and drop off what we can there. We're going to grab the last crate and make our way back before those guys find out we've been walking in and out of their camp and stole one of their lockers. They're probably still looking for it. Going, John, did you put that locker over there? Blame Scott. It's probably Scott's fault. Yeah, this is probably Scott's fault. You guys understand that if you played the last, if you've watched my last few series, Scott has been an integral part of our gameplay. Yes, we have been having fun with him. I'm going to drop that here. I'm going to grab that stick. You know, if this guy is right in front of me. And I'm kind of, okay, so that must have been it. So there, there's probably guys in this camp at all times. I was lucky on the first day that I was able to walk in and out of that place without having to uh, do anything. I mean, you can kill them all, of course, if you get the right stuff and, uh, you know, take over the loot and stuff. Now, the map looks, this house is the same. It has a little bit of differences, including the forge and stuff missing. I'm not mistaken. Uh, there's you near know, the oh, no, it's near the farm. That's right. But there's a car right there instead, so that is okay too. I don't know if these guys will break these things or not. Just grab this over here, move this right there for now. And you know what? I remember well. If you block the door like this, these guys can't come in. I don't think he fixed that. All right, so <laughs> I'm going to take advantage of that. I don't think they'll be able to hit this because it's too low. I don't know if we'll be able to get out ourselves, but it's all good. We're going to drop off everything we can right now because we don't want to carry anything that's good on us. And uh, we'll have to deal with uh, all the extra stuff afterwards. All right, let's make our way out. Uh, again, we'll have to probably do this in and out. Oh, boy, I think I jammed the door. Dudes, do it. Okay, no, we're good. That guy's still smoking right there. He is smoldering. Now, it's a new level tier. Okay, we're not going to be able to do this. Gotcha. Uh, but this is a new level tier, guys, so we have to be careful. There is some that can actually, as we saw last episode, run out in the middle of the... Uh, yeah, run out in the middle of the sun and just take some burning uh, hit points on it. And it will die, supposedly. The other guy just took a lot of pounding before he died. I'm not sure how long it takes for them to sizzle up and gun, like right here across. There is uh, other places across the lake which we can probably hit up really quick. I just want to go back here really, really, really quick and see if we can get lucky. 
and find that axe, which I'm kind of desperate for. I'm going to need that for crafting. A knife would be good, too. I can make a spear out of that. And uh, anything at all, I'll take it right now. I'll take anything at all. These guys in here? Yeah, they're in there, too. All right. Oh, darn it. Uh, there was a camper. I suppose we missed an axe in here or something. You guys didn't say you saw it. You said you found one here. So I'm going to take another look. Because at this point, pff, why not? That's a leaf. Okay. Well, I'll take a second look just to make sure I'm not going crazy here. There it is. All right. Good. Thank you very much for that. And uh, take a bow in the confields. Thank you very much for making sure I go back for some of this stuff. I really don't need rocks, but you know what? To this point, leaves and stuff I don't really need. But I did leave that board there, and I'm going to use that for sure. For sure is... Okay. There's another vehicle right here. Do we... I don't remember. Yeah, that's where we started off. Okay. That's where we started off. It's all good. We'll check out the front and the back here. Sorry, the uh, side and the backs of this building to make sure we didn't forget anything. They can get a little bit frustrated and angry in there, so... Yeah. Yeah, just, just let him be. We'll go across the lake and see if there's anything at all open for us to grab. We do have a fire started. Um, our stamina is tanking, kind of. I should have brought some food because my water is now gone to shites. I don't think we can drink this shit without being sick, right? Unsafe water drink. Yeah, that's it. That's a problem. Okay, we're going to have to go back home and in two seconds. We, we will survive it. It's just going to be a pain in the butt. And hopefully we'll find something in here, too, as possible. Unless it's fully loaded of these zombies. Um, or whatever you want to call them. Can I get up here? Okay, hop on this, then hop around here. Okay, gotcha. Oh, yeah, we have a light, by the way. L is for light. If you guys weren't aware, I, I found out too while I was stuck on top. Went back to check the controls. Said, oh, god darn, that's right. Firewood. That's a nice little start. Fine, we still can't loot these things. You guys saw a wolf skin, I think? It's a wolf, yep. All right. Nothing here. Nothing there. There's some drawers here. This is locked up. So you can either interact with it here. You can actually use a lockpick or a crowbar using this. Also, the crowbar can now be used as a weapon, which is very, very nice. Oh, we can't open up the drawers. That sucks big time. Considering it took us how long to get here? <laughs> Not long. Uh, there's a final shield. You guys know where that's from. There's a lock here. Okay, that's nice. What's on top? Anything? On these shelves, sometimes you get stuff on shelves. I always forget about that when you first start. Okay, it's gonna get dark soon. Whoop, I had to forget. Some more planks and stuff. Okay, we'll turn off the light for now. It's very bright. We'll check the back. Sometimes you get some lucky stuff. There used to be a generator you can take apart and back, and it looks like that's been removed. Okay. Well, so be it. So be it. Let's take a little swim in water and see if we can, our guy can do it. Oh, he's still can swim, but it's just a little different. I don't know if it's really different as much as we still can't go underneath the water. That is infested too, that little place. We really need to get ourselves a weapon. We do have an axe now, which is going to help us out quite a bit. Oh, uh, what? How did I freaking sprain an ankle? All right. We'll put that in our main hand here. We can press one, two, three. Right there. So that's very nice. What can we? Oh, yeah, that's with the left hand. Okay, that's going to be with the shield we're going to have on the other side. Gotcha. Uh, we're going to get ourselves a bandage, I'm not mistaken, to fix this sprained ankle. We're going to have to chop down some trees, too. And then investigate tomorrow morning where we're going. Yeah, I'm dehydrated. I'm everything, dude. I'm everything right now. I can't really run. A little bit of frustration. I was hoping to find stuff up here. Unfortunately, did not find anything. I was really hoping that we'd be able to grab some loot. Now, you can take apart these things. Last we did, we used to take apart an axe. I'm curious to see if we can still take apart these things here. I don't know if it does. It doesn't sound like it's breaking apart. I don't know. It might be. It might be. We'll take a couple more hits afterwards. Remember, well, these axes can go bad after a while. Especially any metal wouldn't be a great idea, would it? No, it wouldn't. Um, all right. Let me uh, go and get my stuff in here, too. We also have doors back on this sucker. This is sweet. Give me back some loot. Yeah, it has my loot there. It's still there. Nice. It also has a little area on the side with a side door, which I don't know if we checked everything here. I think we believe we did. We used to find cogs and stuff, and gears. We used to call them cogs. Uh, gears themselves, but yeah. We can fix up our car too at night if we want to. There is a leaf on the ground. We could take up all the stuff here if we want to. We could leave probably the bottle in there for now. Uh, important stuff, maybe gears. 
motors and stuff like that uh, rocks we can probably just leave them all here for now and leaves the uh, reason why i'm going to do this because it's not that important for right now crafting that i know of maybe there's something different that i'm not aware of but uh, these things are just not important right now for us this is and that, that should be on us and this uh, i'm gonna keep this security wise i don't know just feel like i should okay we're good we're in good shape pick up the sticks get the stuff going uh we'll try to fix up our ankle how do we get ourselves bandaged for this one Bandage your uh, bandage and healing wounds and stop bleeding only. We need alcohol for that. Uh, is there another? We don't have anything else to fix our ankle, do we? Yeah, treatment. Uh, painkillers. I don't think we got any painkillers all through this. We didn't find anything at all. Now, I wonder if the cupboards are back in here too. If that's in there, is the cupboards back? No, they're not. That's just too bad. That really is too bad. Okay, we're dehydrated, so we're gonna grab this and eat. We'll give us a little back of hunger and agua, which we haven't been very lucky. We do have some colas anyways to help us out a tiny bit. Let's see how far that brings us. That's pretty good. I'm going to take a rest of this on a little drink of a cola and keep us off all nice and potched. We'll keep this here like so. And then what I'll do is I'll, uh, I'll put the gears in here for now, temporarily. Not the best lock crate ever, but it's definitely going to do the job for now. Again, no shift click available, so we're going to have to do a little bit of our own work. We'll put those badges in here, which I thought we can do a little more with, but unfortunately, not currently. That's fine. It's fine. Uh, these are good, too. These should take part tables and stuff. Uh, do you need it for crafting and such? So, well, you see, that's that's broken there. Those guys broke through that uh, yesterday night. So, yeah, I don't know if we're going to have a hard time with that or not. Uh, ooh, you guys should be all together here. All right, let's drop that in. Let's go and see. This before night and becomes all hell breaks loose i would like to get out and about for one last shot and see if there's anything up this road here uh we'll leave the saw back here too in case we die and there is a uh, bottom here you can see it 98 percent so me hitting things definitely a big problem but it is a weapon self-healing is gonna be a while again you can try and run it off like you used to but now it doesn't look like it the effect is there once you've sprained it you sprained it it's okay it's okay it's, a, it's gonna be a long a little walk across a little frustrating especially as for a stupidity of a maneuver going up here but i see a truck on top you guys were saying the army trucks have stuff damage so i'm going to jump into the back of that let's see if we can do this here i'm not happy with the guards being right next to us that's for sure but i do like their camps a lot better than they used to be i think the caps looks a whole lot better okay all right there's some uh, no fuel in this sucker nothing no loot. Do we already do this? I suppose he added deer or two to this game. I don't see anything around it either. Is there anything down there? No. What time is it? We'll press tab. 1300 hours. That's good. 3 o'clock in the afternoon. Almost 4. There's some static cars there we can take apart. And that's with the sledgy. I figure the metal back there we should take it apart with the sledgehammer too. I'm pressing a shift key. I don't know why. It's not, not as if it's going to work for us. The street's completely different. This road is completely redone. Oh, God, there's no loot. Nothing in this one either. That's not good. Not a good start at all. Go we'll back and check the RV vehicle in a few seconds here. Not seeing very much loot anywhere. A lot of static cars we can take apart from scrap and stuff. Nothing either. Oh, boy. Okay, game's getting a little harder than it used to be. Used to find stuff all the time. I wonder why it's so much less. Is that maybe something an update's gonna be done? I'm not sure. Ah, right, we freaking sticks are around. It is a darker game than before. You guys will see a little better than I will because, of course, I will do some editing and make it a little bit brighter and cleaner for you guys to see. There is a place to the left. There is possibly a bear nearby, if I'm mistaken, around this area. And we can't run right now, so it's going to suck if we screw up. Hopefully this is not... Oh my god, that scared me. It's a freaking statue out of nowhere. What the hell? That's some scary stuff. There's a lion statue over there, too. I just didn't expect it. I'm not used to that. Oh! Good stuff, good stuff, good stuff. All right, we got ourselves a knife. Let's make ourselves a spear. Okay, we'll turn on the lights here. Oh, we have another locker. That is wicked. Let's open it up here. 
All right, we got some more canned tomatoes, some more matches. We can drop everything in there and bring it with us if we want to, and just do a little walk about at the same time and carry it with us. Uh, the knife is going to stay with me. Uh, we can craft up a spear. Let's see what it looks like. Is it with hardwood? I think it's hardwood. It takes six of them. If not mistaken. Where is that again? We're seeing that here. Weapons. Uh, it takes one. All right, only one. All right, let's just do it. Let's split the stack, split in half, whatever. It's all good. And we'll craft this baby. How long does it take to do whittling this down? 20 minutes. Okay, hold on a second. <laughs> we're, not, we're not ready to waste 20 minutes right now. Uh, but it's it's not uh, it's not going to happen. Okay, let's just look at the back door. Anything else around here? Because we got to go do some logging anyways. So we're all good. We're all good. I don't want to walk into Mr. Bear either. God, I'm hoping that sprain is going to heal itself faster. I was hoping for some pills or something. Little blocks here too. Someone here was carving up some stuff. All right. We can't take this road back down here. It's so different, ladies and gents. We do have that thing down here we can hit. I don't really want to hit that bear. I'm going to be honest with you guys. I'm not a big fan of the bear. I don't know when he spawns in now. It would be a little bit more of a pain in the butt than before. So let me head down this road here. We'll meet right up. All right, so the army truck is right there. There's a school bus, there's those things over there. Again, we have the bad guys over there. So I just walked down the street and I uh, was hoping we we're going to find some stuff on top of this. Just drop this here for now. All right, nothing on top of this either. Doesn't look like there's anything on top of here. No loot at all. This is gone too. No fuel, no nothing. That is not good, ladies and gents. Not good at all. None whatsoever. I'm hoping to find a little more stuff uh, to keep us going here, especially at the beginning. But again, it could just be the area that looted in. <laughs> we did take quite a bit of stuff, but not enough. No pills and stuff. We usually find tons of those. Maybe it's going to force us to go to the big city now. I don't know if they expanded the map. I think he did. He was planning on it, at least. That was going to be a little different. I mean, remaking a whole entire area is pretty insane, too. Yeah, this is empty here. It's all empty. What's that over here? I know the guys are right over there to my left, but you know what? At this point, whatever. All right, oh, stick. <laughs> Freaking Christ. All right, yep, yeah, it's not good. Mm, the mirror almost clipped me there. I think these trucks are the wrong size. I'm pretty, you know, I'm the tallest dude ever. My cap seems a little bit too small. Might have to resize that a tiny bit. Again, I don't know how easy that is to do, so. I'll take the cloth. It looks like there's some stuff on the ground more than anything else. There might be stuff up here. I don't know if we checked that. Now, they don't seem to be protecting this part. Freaking stick again, really? Okay, come on, jump up. They're not protecting very well their area here. Oh, my God. What's this on here? There's something else. Oh, it's a freaking leaf. <laughs> it's okay. We found the M4. All right, it's not going to be loaded. I can guarantee you that right now. That gun is not going to be loaded. What's so freaking ever? Uh, we're going to put our gun in a number one. Oh, because I have it in hand. Okay. No, zero, zero. All right. It's okay to have zero, zero. We have some at home. Not a ton, but maybe enough to uh, wipe out these guys and find out what they're carrying on them. We did clear out this camp, though. Maybe wasting it wouldn't be a good idea. Maybe it wouldn't be a good idea. All right, I'm going to grab the locker and make my way back. I'm happy I found an M4 finally. Someone did mention that. And again, take a bow for that, too. Looks like the M4 is exactly there. I think it's the same person, too. Uh, where the hell did I put my locker? There I did. There I did. Good English. Let's grab this baby up, and I'll walk back to the camp. I'm not going to bore you guys. And I'll see you guys here in a few seconds. Now, supposedly the one that's in front here that was burning is afraid of fire. I don't know if the rest are. I'm hoping they all are. Some of them you think that free to fire would be kind of important uh, for some of them, but I guess they are, not all of them are going to be. I don't know. He said free to fire. He wrote down the notes in there. I did try and look over the notes a little bit. I spent the night pretty much working on this, uh, getting the video out. Limited sleep, but a whole lot of fun. And uh, yeah, we'll grab those back out. We're going to put this back in here. We're putting our rocks in here and our leaves and uh, everything else I'm keeping here for now. We could probably use this for afterwards. We're going to have to make some arrows. We'll see if we can get that completed. All right. We're going to drop down on the tree, too. I don't know if that will affect the sprain of ankle on the right-hand side and make it worse. 
I remember something's used to. I'll just rotate here for now. Luck at number two. Lock it up. Okay, one of you here has uh, some stuff. I think it's actually that locker right here. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to make these lockers a little more straight afterwards. Just don't have time right now. All right, what do we have here? 7.62, which I think that would be right. There's a rifle ammo. And what do we have right now, actually? The M4. So the M4 carbine uh, takes this one here, and this one is for the hunting rifle. All right, nice. Which might be a sniper, I think, that we used to be use. I think we used to use that. All right, grab this. We load that baby with the R. Nice. Nice little M4 action going on. Look at us. Look at us. Oh, my lordy. We're back home. We're back home, baby. Been a few seasons of playing this, and I missed it tremendously. I'm not going to lie to you guys. Like, tremendously. Uh, what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to move my rifle to number one. That's where I need it to be. And then we're going to also make ourselves some stuff here. First, we're going to chop down this tree and see how hard it is. If it's changed up quite a bit. All right, it's not affecting my ankle, which used to give me like an orange bar going through it. Put it on our light so you guys can see. It looks like another mist is coming in, dudes and duets. I really can't afford to have that again. We didn't see any chickens either. I'm not sure if I'm in the right spot or not. Usually chickens are actually go up a little bit further up to the left. I'm not sure if that's going to be a problem. All right, the trees seem to be about the same as last. Oh, I wonder if they have the double trees still. Those things are awesome. And then you can usually hit this baby up afterwards and get a little more loot. And it's easier to knock down. So the stump, pick up logs, which we're going to need. Pick up everything you can on the ground that this tree will give. And sooner or later, we'll never need any of this stuff. And we'll be like, oh, how do we get rid of it? Put it in the fire, get rid of it. But for now, it's all like goodies. It's all the good stuff that we need. We are going to venture out a little bit further to survive here. Again, on the sprained ankle, and stupidity of a sprained ankle, I should say, because it really it was one of the stupidest moves I've done. And I think we can drop some stuff in here. So we have tinder itself. So this is a good source of ignite and fire easily. So we can put the tinders in there. And the logs and stuff we can stockpile. I'm going to shoot them in here for now. What I'll do is I'll grab the motor and everything else, put it into the car. There's two spark plugs on the ground. Sorry if it's bright sometimes. Sometimes it isn't. Um, yeah, so we can... Grab this. Just drop these in here for now. Temporarily. A little storage area, and we can move them afterwards and deal with it. We'll have to wait a tiny bit, but we'll deal with it. We could just put the engine inside and get start getting rolling. We still need wheels. And a jerry can itself is kind of handy. I will need to go around and start doing some work like that afterwards. Um, I might need these. I don't remember why. I just keep on remembering I need them. I just don't remember why. This barrel here used to be able to take apart pretty easily. It was a broken... Oh, no, there we go. There's actually a... You see it? There we go. As long as you have that, we're in good shape. That's wicked. A little scrap of stuff. Wicked, wicked, wicked. All right, let's go find our matches. We're going to need them very shortly. What time is it? Yeah, it's uh, 5 o'clock only. Guys, it's really dark in here for 5 o'clock. I'll be honest with you guys. It's pretty darn dark. We'll put that in the other one over there. And uh, we're going to need some wood and stuff. So we do have some fire logs, which we were able to grab last time. I think they're right here. You guys have a couple of fire logs. They'll help us out quite a bit. And these scrap can go on the other side. This is charcoal. We can use that later on for crafting. We're going to need those. Uh, these need to go on the other side, and that needs to go outside. And there is our feathers. Wicked. Just got to sort things out, make sure we're in order, and get yourself so we're not looking. I forgot to put the spark plugs outside. you got to appreciate that. Let's turn off our light to you. And this here. What is this? Revolver, right? So we need another one. I guess what we can do is grab this, 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 and this. And we're going to have to keep one for food anyway. So we'll keep one for food and one for agua. And we'll put... Oh, there's my matches. I knew I had some extra matches somewhere. We have tons of them. 21 total. Really nice start. Really nice start. Okay, so there you go. Make that eight there. And uh, there's another eight stack right there. We'll put those right on the bottom. Fantastic. Let's start up our fire. Uh, we'll drop the matches in here. And we're going to be putting in some fire logs. So maybe split in half. And ignite. 
Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. Remember? Yeah, it worked right good. We have 59 minutes with that. And I think we can put some sticks in here. Let's just see what split half. Yeah, so it gives us a little more time. I don't know what the max is. I remember there was a max. But success rate is written there by times you, whatever you have in there, of course, to ignite it. Very cool. We also have coal. And I don't know if that's used for the fire or not, or just for actual crafting. It's very possible. <laughs> it's very possible. Okay, and uh, the rocks. There we go. Nice. Now everybody's all happy. We got ourselves all stacked up and ready to go properly. Feeling good. I'm going to craft up to the uh, find because it's getting darker now. And it's only, they don't really they come out, but not as much at night. Uh, we could cook up some stuff in here if we want to. We also can uh, quick fuel firewood queue destroy or interact. Can I put it out? I can't put it out right now. All right, we still can't put it out. It's all good. Okay, um, that being said, we're going to pick you up. Mr. Army Crate, pain in the butt that you are. But you are quite large enough to block that entrance from issues, I think. Which will be pretty good. I don't think there's anything important in... Actually, you're very important. <laughs> okay, it's all good. All right, let's uh, face over here. And we're going to craft up that spear I promised to get done. And get completed. Let's craft that baby up. I want to see what she looks like. Absolutely. freaking -lutely. Okay, and then we're just going to do this. Oops, sorry. Not that. There, that. And we're going to do we'll move the stuff down in here. All right, and there's also nails and stuff, which I don't have currently. I want to make that shield. Uh, I don't think we found any nails whatsoever. We still need to find ourselves a hammer itself, which is going to be coming up very shortly. How are we doing on hunger? I got to wait it off a little bit more so I can gain more back from it. We will need to sleep also. And uh, what do we need for that? I need to make myself a sleep bag. That's what I got caught on last time. We need feathers. That's where it is. Six feathers. Two swankets. I have not found one. And a rag. I don't know. Maybe we'll be able to sleep on the ground here uh, elsewhere. We'll have to probably wait to see. Uh, remember, we'll be able to sleep on the ground for some reason. But we'll have to check it out. So, very, very cool. I could board this back up on a rapid repair. Uh, again, not the greatest. But uh, definitely something we could do. Hmm. I don't have nails. That's going to suck big time. We might have to move this to here and block the entrance for them coming in that way they can't get in and out very very possible also making sure probably that we have to keep our stuff on us okay so for sleeping i figured it out there i went to look in the controls and see what we can do we're actually going to sleep the night right here by pressing number seven you can do it i'm going to turn off the lights so you guys can see it you can place yourself down won't be as good rested as the sleeping bag but i thought we needed a sleeping bag we do not so press seven and you got that rolling you can sleep the night away and hopefully in the daylight everything is so much better it usually is. Uh, we'll eat this baby up. Also passes time. Don't forget every time you do something, eating and everything else, it does pass some time. It's 6 o'clock in the morning. I don't know how much sleep we're going to get from this. Uh, let's try it out. Let's see what we can do. All right. We can select here. Uh, boy, that's I got a little bit of time left. I might wait that out. I'm going to do a little bit of sorting downstairs and maybe sorting out to make sure I don't lose anything in here in case we do get broken into. So, yeah, I'll do that before we go. And then tomorrow morning, we should be self-healed and built to run again. It'll be awesome. So thank you for being here. You guys are absolutely amazing. This is Gamage, and I'll catch you guys on the flip side.